That is definitely going my top epic moments I got out of a corner. Now, I know last episode I was talking about how this game's kind of easy. And, you know, to an extent, it's a lot easier than I remember it being. But I believe, like, you know, it's not like I want to make it to, like, round 100 my first time through. Like, look at me. I'm a delusional little bitch just now. And look at me. I'm down again. Holy fuck, dude. Hey, you nice cock, man. You, but the difference is, like, I, I think it's just me being more mature than I was, like, you know, back then, you know? It, because, like, looking back at it, like, that down, like, oh my god, that down would hurt my self-esteem to the point where I'm just like, I just fucking suck at everything, don't I? Like, why am I even playing this? Like, my friends are gonna make fun of me. They don't even acknowledge me in school. This is getting a little too personal. Okay, what map are we gonna be playing now? I have no idea. Oh, look, there's new features. Oh my, wow. You don't play Buried yet on the channel. I remember there was a time in my life where, I, like, I didn't even acknowledge Origins as the last zombies map because I just didn't like it that much. It was truly a strange time in my life. I remember looking at that plane. I'm like, oh my god, they brought the, uh, they brought back the jet gun. Oh my god. Oh, can we do it? Damn it. We don't have the ray gun. I remember the first time that happened to me, I, I couldn't fucking believe that. Me and my brother were playing. It was the craziest shit ever. Like him, I, he couldn't believe it. I couldn't believe it. I remember real with you, I never even looked over at that direction before. Now I think about it. If I throw grenades down there, will I get points? I don't think I will. Buried was just such a Good zombies map, yeah? And like, like, well, whether you love it or hate it, man, like, I... Like, like, like out of all the, like, the, like, the green run, like, Victus and all that stuff, like, out of all of them... God, dude. God, mm, it's just the best map out of all three of them. Just because, like, the map flows well, you know? Like, like I think the biggest issue with, like, like, Transit and Die Rise is, like, the movement in, in those maps just fucking suck. If you wanted to go somewhere, you would have to wait for the bus and Transit and... And for Die Rise, like, if a friend got down in, like, a previous building, you would have to loop around the entire map. Like, you couldn't go backward. Like, there was no... I mean, there was trample seams, but, like, one per player, you know? Like, if you fuck that up, dude, if you fuck up that jump, dude, mm, I don't know what developers or, like, just companies don't understand. Like, I'm socially awkward. I don't have any friends. Stop making maps based around me having to have friends. For Christ's sake. Oh, it's round two already. Uh, one of the coolest things, though, was definitely the LSAT. The LSAT is probably still, like, one of the coolest things. Like, as a starting room thing, this right here is is probably like, one of the biggest things. Uh, is like, 3,000 points or something? I believe it is. I, I don't know. Look, dude, this is the fact... I, I forgot. I'm pretty sure it's 3,000, right, for the LSAT. I don't know why it wouldn't be. Uh, see, looking back, I'm surprised they didn't put, like, a spawn right here. I, I feel like that would have, like, made this entire area, like, just a risk to be in. I get to the... Door? Oh my god, I can. Not the door, the fucking window. Look, at, oh, it's 2,000? Oh my god, it's so much easier than I remember it being. Uh, again, like, Buried is definitely one of those cooler maps, for sure. Just because you get to, like, choose, like, where, like what goes where, you know? And, like, like you, you really got to, like, a, just a fucking detail in your friend's personalities. It's like, you put the PDW where? Like, you, I don't want to be friends with you anymore. Like, that's what I don't understand about people. Like, to me, the PDW was just clearly better than the AK. Uh, mostly because it was my favorite weapon, but uh, I have no bias. Why would I? But no, like, in my head, like, the PDW just has more ammo than the AK, you know? It's 50 bolts in a mag, you know? What does the AK have? Just 20? That's weak shit. That's like 30 less than what I carry in a mag, you know? You know how many magazines do you have to go through? Two? Just to compare to one of mine? Now, yes, I do believe they have the same amount of ammo, but listen, at the end of the day, fuck you, I'm right. I'm deflecting a lot in these past two videos, aren't I? So, yeah, I know I just went down. I know I sucked the game. Also, this feature right here, the, the teddy bear on top of the box, I really thought it was like a like a glitch at first. Like, they didn't finish making the map, if only I knew. That's 12. It, it, may, it has made me, like, respect this weapon so much more, just because of VR, you know? I gave daddy the alcohol. Damn, Daniel. Oh my god, guys, look, it's the secret perk. Oh my god, dude. Oh my god. Look, it's even up there. I'm surprised no one ever pointed that out. They always pointed it out on the ground, but there's, it's literally just sitting up there. Okay. I was not prepared for this. Oh, shit. The thing about these maps, it always felt like the zombies would always be there when you didn't need them to be. <sighs> I need to open the bar so daddy can get his drink. I don't want the bite of 87 ever happening again. Like, I, I know Leroy was in, um, whatever his name is. Uh, Dreisendrak, but like, how did he get here? forgot. Daddy, I swear to God, if you fuck this up, I'm gonna be kind of pissed. Oh, he didn't hit the pole. Epic gaming moment. That zombie is me when my dad is drunk. I loved this, like, this fat- Like, how could you hate Buried, man? Before you say, like, oh, Buried was too easy because they just gave you access to, like, wherever you wanted anything. Uh, first of all, Mob of the Dead exists, okay? Mob of the Dead is easy. 
Okay. Like looking back at it, like Mom of the Dead's probably the easiest map out there. Um, just because um, how do I put this? Uh, like three quick revive is a map. Like every round, and like it just keeps refreshing is fucking bullshit if you ask me. You know, there's something you can do with dead, uh, dead shot with this thing. I forgot what it was. I need to find a way back up in the mine, you know? I feel like that's just the smartest decision, but I need that area of the map open. Is there no way I can get back up there through the saloon? Oh, I think about it. I believe there is, but I'm also kind of an idiot. Also, should I buy that? I'm gonna buy uh, whatever it's called. Wait, I don't fall through this? This makes no sense. What the fuck is this? What the hell? Well, then again, I mean, it is Call of Duty. It is Call of Duty. I didn't think they would be able to program something so... Um... Intricate. Do I get like an achievement? I probably don't, but like just drawing on walls or something. Because if I do, why have I never done this before? I want to say the last chalk drawing gives me at least 2,000. Like at least 2,000. Better give me more. Because I believe the last two are over here. I remember when Buried came out, I didn't even know it came out. Like I, I was at like, believe it or not, I played, I did sports at one point and I played soccer and one of my uh, teammates told me that, hey, are you going to play the new Zombies map later? I'm like, what do you mean? Yeah, it comes out tomorrow. I'm like, w what? It was buried, nonetheless. And I remember when I dropped, dude. Oh, it was fantastic. I remember, like, I was just so fascinated with Misty's boobs as a child. Like, I was so sad to learn that people thought Victus was dead. Through, uh, whatever it's called. Uh, oh, oh, buried. Yeah, I forgot the name of the map for a second. Should I get Vulturate? I don't, eh, fuck it. Well, one of the things that pisses me off about custom maps is, like, they never get Vulturate right, you know? Because, like, the Vulture Aid, like, it doesn't, like, things don't come into view until, like, you're actually close to it, you know? Like, I believe it will always tell you where Box is, but, like, it, yeah. Yeah, it's just kind of stupid. Because, like, in custom maps, like, oh my god, Vulture Aid just pops off everywhere, man. The thing I love about Vulture Aid, like, it's gonna be really weird and really stupid, but, like, the eyes grow more blue, you know? Like, like, the, the blue is brighter. There we go. I don't know why I said it like that. Okay. Okay. Epic. Also, another thing that kind of upsets me about the custom paralyzer is that it just kind of sucks, to be honest with you. It just feels very underwhelming and, like, very weak, you know, compared to this behemoth. Also, I don't think I can even fly with the custom paralyzer in custom zombies, which... I don't know why. You get more perks in this map, I remember that. I don't know why more zombies maps haven't done that, like, like, ways you can get more perks, you know? I feel like that would technically fix the problem, you know? You know, you, you get the first four f that are most... Oh, fuck. Uh, you get the first four that are most important to you. And then, I don't know, you allow the player to get the rest of it. If they really want to. And I'm not talking about, like, doing the main Easter egg type thing. I'm talking about, like, you know, some side Easter egg where you have to shoot something in, a, in the saloon. And then you can go buy the perks, you know? Or, or, like, being able to get through the house or something. I forgot what you get. Like, is it without getting hit or something? I believe it is. Like, without getting hit in the house. You know, like, like things like that. I think they're important. I believe there's one more chalk drawing I have yet to do, right? There is. Like, I better get 2,000 for this. I'm gonna be kind of upset if I don't. Now, if I had the option to draw somewhere, where would I draw? Probably the church. Oh, I did get 2,000. That's comical. I just got PhD. I'm gaming tonight. Also, talk about a cool map, you know? This is the map that introduced the Mark II. Can we just talk about that? Pretty neat map, if you ask me. You, you know, like, nowadays, we just make the Mark II the wonder weapon of the map instead of introducing, I don't know, the Paralyzer. Because, I mean, honestly, that's what they would do. I mean, they did it with Alpha Omega in a way, but, I mean, I guess it did make it a little interesting. I mean, with Duran Fong, that's what they did, you know? They just added a ray gun and called it a death. But first of all, why? Second of all, why is it even a map? You know, I don't want to talk about Vanguard. Let's not talk about Vanguard. Whenever I talk about Vanguard, I get angry. And uh, just one thing about Vanguard real quick, you know, like, they talked about how they were making Shino Numa a round-based map again. And, like, they were adding an Easter egg to the map as well. And my direct thoughts following those statements were, Okay, and? Like, well, what else is there? And, uh, there was nothing else. And, yeah, I know, it's probably hard being a dev, and I, I don't know their situation. Like, I don't know what they're doing. But, like, I don't know. Like, do you really expect me to get excited about Shino Numa? A map from World at War? Like, you know how long I've had access to that map? And do you honestly believe they're going to be adding new areas to the map? Like, dude, they can barely make a functioning game. We just got a pause feature last month or something. And honestly, like, I'll be surprised if they add a new perk. I don't think they will, but I mean, dude, come on. The next Call of Duty has been announced, and there's no new perk, and there's no round- mm. I remember doing the buried Easter egg one time, and I think this is where I want to end the video on. He was doing the Easter egg with, with a guy, and my brother, and another guy. Oh my gosh, thinking about it pisses me off. And, um, this guy- we're on the sharpshooter step, right? We're on the last step. 
And, um, this guy had 27 downs. And, like, it wasn't because of connection. It wasn't because of bullshit. It was just because the guy wanted to get carried in Easter Egg. But when we got to the sharpshooter step, we just couldn't carry him. Because he was just shooting, like, one area of the, sh of the, of the targets. And if you know, like, there's multiple areas you have to look in each direction. Like, he was doing this area, actually. And I was doing Saloon. And, um... I switched with the guy. Because I'm like, I just want to see. I just want to test something. And I made sure I hit all my targets, right? And and the one guy hit all of his targets. The good guy. And then my brother hit all of his targets. Because I, I we played right next to each other. So, like, I was able to see his screen, you know? And before you say, like, how do you know if he hit all your targets? Well, I knew my brother was looking in all directions. And I know my brother is, I don't know, capable of doing it on his own. So, like, like, if I saw my brother, like, just, like, not moving at all, I would, like, know. But the guy wasn't moving at all. It was clear. And that's how we end today's video. Just bitching about this map. Dude, this map's great, but god, dude, I fucking... Mm.